Hey there, Earth Angels. Thanks for stopping by Born of the Rose. Thanks for clicking on your tarot card reading for the day. This, this has been an ordeal for me just to get this video done today. It's kind of interesting. Some days I'm able to get a whole bunch of videos done. Other days, like today's Tuesday, I wanted to get these out on the first. No. Oh well. I'm happy to be able to do them now. <sighs> Don't be afraid to try new things. Don't be afraid to ask for help if you're getting stuck and you don't know what's going on and it's overwhelming. Don't be afraid to ask for guidance. Don't let fear change what you're doing. Choose from love. Love can also feel like joy. Something feels good. That's the love choice. Outside influences could tell you that's not the love choice. They could tell you that's your greed, that's your whatever. If it feels good, it probably is good. That's all. So, I hope you're doing well. Um, got these funny headphones here that I'm using for the microphone. Better, a better microphone should be than the one I was using before. So I hope the sound quality is better. If it is, let me know. Mm. Yeah, there's a loud motorcycle going by. Spirit guides, please be with me now. Ancestors, please guide and guard this reading for truth, compassion, and forbearance. Bring forth the most clear, concise, accurate messages for our Earth Angel Collective. What our Earth Angels need to know today for their highest and best enfoldment, for their highest joy expression in this now moment to work through whatever the energies are that they need to work through in this place. Oh. What's the overall theme for our Earth Angels for right now, Spirit? Queen of Swords. Strong feminine energy. Intellectual feminine energy. Eloquent in speech. He's not afraid. What more can we say about the overall theme for our Earth Angels? The Hermit. It's a card of Virgo. Um, it's a card of turning inward to find your truth, what's true for you. Anything else we can say about the overall theme spirit for the Earth Angels? And the Chariot. A very different energy from the Hermit energy. The Hermit is the slowest moving energy, and the Chariot is the fastest moving energy. So, duality. Maybe you're having a desire to move something forward. You're like, well, I've found the truth, so now I can move forward. That could be the case. Spirit, what energies are coming towards our Earth Angels in this now time? We have the Fool. A new beginning is coming towards you. Fool energy is coming towards you. What else is coming towards the Earth Angels, Spirit? Coming, what more can we say about this fool energy? Six of Cups, nostalgia, positive feelings from the past. You have good feelings. Like this could be past life connection, but it's, it's good feelings at home that you have with someone or something from before. A good feeling that's come forward with you. We can say that it's like a high school chum or friend or a college friend, someone from your past, you know, childhood friends. Could be that. 
could be past life, love, some kind. Spirit, what more can we say about the full energy that's coming towards the Earth Angel Collective? Agape love. This is that fullness of heart. So the Two of Cups would be Venusian energy, like Venus energy. The Ten of Cups would be Neptune. So this is higher love that's felt. Six of Cups turning into a Ten of Cups. Bring me that higher love. Oh, well, just saying. Spirit, what more can we say? Oh, whoa, we already did. That's what's coming towards. Spirit, are there any crossing energies that our... Earth angels are going to want to be mindful of a sense of walking away. Maybe the need to walk away from something that isn't serving you. Anything else, Spirit, that we could say about a crossing energy? You need to put the burdens down. Feeling overburdened. So a feeling of walking away and a feeling of doing everything on your own, being left to do it all on your own, that sense of being overburdened. Anything else for a crossing energy spirit? And also the feeling of being good on your own. Nine of Cups. Nine of Cups is self-satisfaction. Not needing anybody else. Hmm. Interesting. Spirit, what advice do you have for our earth angels for this week? For this energy that we're in right now. Balance your pentacles. Balance the physical plane. Find balance and harmony. Oh, that's all, Spirit. Okay, got it. Hmm, anything else, Spirit? Do you have advice for our Earth Angels? Focus on the abundance. This is a card of abundance. This is ultimate abundance. Spirit's talking about keeping things focused on the physical plane here with the Ten of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. Any other advice, Spirit, before we close this thing out here for the Earth Angels? Page of Swords, something new. Don't be afraid to be inexperienced at something and go for it. Hmm. This is my fourth attempt to record this video, by the way. I... First time around, it was a very long video and I went really in depth on a lot of different things and I took multiple phone calls, kept coming in, so I had to just keep stopping and restarting. And I was like, no problem, I'll just use this, you know, one app to splice them together. I went to open the app and it's asking me to make a, to pay for a subscription. I'm like, no, no, I'm not, okay, we're not going to use that app. Download a new free one, no problem. Download the new app. You know, load in the you know the clips, get them in the right order. Things are great. Go to save it. Not enough space in your phone to save. Yes, yes, there is. So I go and I clear out extra stuff from the phone. Go to save it. Oh, clips are gone. Okay, no problem. We'll re-record. And then that one got disrupted. And then the next one got disrupted. It's like, well, if I can't edit. <laughs> oh my word fun with technology it, and I'm sure there's plenty of space on my phone for to be able to save so it's just a thing don't give up if something, keep, if something you really want to do and something keeps coming at you like a curveball don't give up I knew if I stopped stopped worrying about it when did something else for a bit, I'd be able to come back and record. 
and it would be fine. I was right. This time. Anyway, I hope you have a wonderful day, my friends, and I hope your week goes beautifully for you. Um, I hope the message resonates and it's helpful. Remember, this is a collective reading. This is not a one-on-one. -on -one. So not everything in there may resonate. Please don't try to force something into your life that doesn't fit. That's all I got for you, my friends. If you liked it, put the thumbs up. Drop a comment down below if you want. Click subscribe if you want. But please remember to drink enough water and hug your loved ones, if you would, please. From my heart to yours, I'm sending you love, I'm sending you peace. Thanks for stopping by.